BEA's BR3 is a programmable three relay logic module with 12 functions. This video will cover how to program functions 10 and 11. The BR3 offers one wet and four dry inputs, three relay outputs, and ACDC power. To configure the wet dry settings and the ACDC power, adjust the jumper positions. Refer to the BR3 user's guide for specific wiring and setup requirements based on the desired function in use. Function 10, also known as the simple timer function, provides an activation of relay 1 triggered by input 1. The function also provides an option for reverse logic on the activation of input 1. This function is commonly used in knowing act pedestrian automatic door applications. Upon initial power up, or if you wish to change the set function, press and hold both push buttons for 3 seconds. Once released, this will activate the display, which will now toggle between FF and 00 for 5 seconds. Press the increment button to cycle through the functions. Stop once the display flashes the desired function. Once you've selected your desired function, set the parameters for that function. Press the parameter button to cycle through each available parameter. Function 10 has two available parameters, H1 and RL. H1 defines relay 1 hold time. To set H1, press the increment button to select the parameter's value. H1 has values 00 through 60 available, representing the number of seconds for hold time. RL defines the activation logic of input 1. RL has values 00 and 01 available. 00 is for normal logic where the activation device at input 1 has a normally open contact. 01 is for reverse logic where the activation device at input 1 has a normally closed contact. To set RL, press the increment button. To save the configuration, allow the display to become inactive. Once programming is complete, test the BR3. Trigger the timer via input 1. Ensure that relay 1 activates and its hold time behaves as programmed. The display will show R1 when relay 1 is energized and 10 when de-energized. Function 11, also known as the ratchet latching function, provides a ratcheting latching of relay 1 triggered by input 1. Each trigger of input 1 will change the state of relay 1. Upon initial power up, or if you wish to change the set function, press and hold both push buttons for 3 seconds. Once released, this will activate the display, which will now toggle between FF and 00 for 5 seconds. Press the increment button to cycle through the functions. Stop once the display flashes the desired function. Function 11 has no parameters. Once programming is complete, test the BR3. Trigger the ratchet via input 1. Ensure that relay 1 changes state and that it is maintained. The display will show R1 when relay 1 is energized. Trigger the ratchet again via input 1 and ensure relay 1 changes state again. The display will show 11 when relay 1 is de-energized. Functions 10 and 11 on BEA's BR3X are programmed using the same procedure as the BR3.